Hey guys, hello and welcome to another Photoshop tutorial by PSD World. In this video, I will show you how to make your vacation photos look amazing. So here is our image. The first step which we are going to do is adjusting the contrast. So click on the levels adjustment layer icon. Click on the drop down menu, select auto options. Here Photoshop has different algorithms. Check enhance monochromatic contrast and check on snap neutral midtones. You can also select different algorithms but for this image enhanced virtual contrast works the best and press ok. Now the second step is to fix the details in the shadows. So click on the curves adjustment layer icon and increase the light in the shadow region. Here we have increased the light in the highlights also so we are going to fix this so select the gradient tool set the foreground color to black select the foreground to transparent gradient draw a gradient as shown draw a gradient from the top to bottom you can see that using the gradient on a layer mask we have only affected the shadow area of our photograph now the third step is to enhance the vibrance of the image so click on the vibrance adjustment layer the little triangle icon increase the vibrance to 20 now the fourth step is the increasing clarity or sharpness of the image if required. Press Ctrl Shift Alt E on the keyboard. This will create a new layer with all the properties of the underneath adjustment layers. Go to filter, click on convert for smart filters and press OK. You can see that the layer has been turned into a smart filter. Go again to filter, other, high pass and accordingly set the radius to 5 pixels and press OK. Set the blend mode of this layer to overlay. You can also adjust the opacity of this layer. Notice the increase in the clarity of the image before and after. You can also check my other tutorial on how to increase the clarity of an image on my YouTube channel. Let's group these layers which we have made. Hold the shift key to select from top to bottom and press ctrl or command G on the keyboard. And we are done. Hope you enjoyed this video. Give this method a try and let me know how it turns out. Please like this video. Also post your comments in the comment box below. Also like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. Support my work on Patreon.com. Follow us on Google+. Check out more videos related to Photoshop on our YouTube channel. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date with my future content. Take care.